how to cancel a transaction on MetaMask. Hello guys, welcome into this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can cancel. Let's see if it can be possible to cancel a transaction in MetaMask. So as you can see, I already have my MetaMask already in here, my extension. Uh, I've already signed in and you might see in your activity that there's a transaction that says pending. So this is an example of a transaction that you might see it says pending. So and this one is going to take or is taking more than uh, the average time. So what you guys want to do is to go into your MetaMask. Let's go into the three dots. Let's go into our profile and let's go into settings. And then in here what you guys want to find is the experimental uh, site, which in that case I'm going to enable my engaged gas fee UI. So actually this is going to be helping us to uh, work a little bit more faster our transactions. I'm going to enable this. And the reason why I wanted to make this a little bit more faster is because there is no way that we can cancel a transaction guys so let's say you didn't put the contract correctly or the address or the network so if you already send that kind of uh, transactions into um, you make a mistake so the chances that you're gonna be losing that cryptos that tokens is really really high guys because that's the world of cryptos speaking about this kind of transactions you can't cancel these transactions and you can't receive their money back but just in case you're making a transaction that is taking too long and you're still expecting that. So in the same example, you're going to see something like this after you select your transaction details. And what you guys want to do is to select the option that says view on Etherscan so you can see the real time transaction. So in your transactions on the confirmation duration says that there's a pending TX sensor. What you guys want to do is to select the TX sensor so you can see uh, the option that says view more. And if you select the option that says view more down below, you're going to see that your nonce, your position is uh, in the case, in this case of the transaction is 457. So that information works for us if you go into your MetaMask and copy your clipper so you can send, uh, let's paste your address right in here. And right here in the funds for the gas, what you guys want to do, let's go back into an example, is that there's a gas price in here and a gas limit. So what you guys want to do is to put a little bit more uh, that it's right here where it says gas price. Uh, if it says 33 and the other one says 55 and three zeros, you have to put 56 for example. But unfortunately, this is going to be like a, a transaction fee. Uh, it sometimes takes $3, sometimes it takes a little bit less, but if you want to do this for free, actually it just won't be available. We have to wait till the transaction is done. And just as I told you before, if you make the transaction, if you already made the transaction and you wanted to cancel that, your tokens are most probably to be gone and you won't get it back. So the last thing that I recommend you guys, just in case you make a huge mistake, to go into need help, contract MetaMask support. So in here, you're going to see that there are tons of articles and it depends on the exact situation that you have. You can start a real conversation with MetaMask support uh, just in case you can find the answer and you want something really, really specific. And let's see if you can recover your tokens on the transaction, guys. So there you have it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about MetaMask. Thank you for watching the video and I'll be seeing you guys on the next one.